So welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a and a with well. my sister. <laughs> yeah, um, so they're just questions that I found online because obviously I'm not popular enough to um, get some <laughs> questions sent in to me. Oh, but yeah, lovely. <laughs> let's get on with the video. Okay, so uh, first, oh. This is my sister Sean, by the way. How old are you? I'm 15. 15, lovely. 18 so, and I'm, you're 18 and I'm still taller than you. Yes, as you guys know from my previous video, I am actually probably just five foot. Um, so yeah, let's get on with the video. <laughs> let's not talk about my height. Um, <laughs> get off! <laughs> Stop! Uh, right. Um, Favourite place in the world? Mine would probably be Greece because it's this place called Kefalonia, Kefalonia in Greece. Um, they have like, I think they filmed Mamma Mia there. Mm. They're, yeah, it's just really nice. I like it. I probably liked Kefalonia as well because the caves, I thought they were so cool. So it's like this dormant volca volcano and you like go into it on a boat and it's it's really nice it's like so yeah. nice. <laughs> <laughs> okay so second no we're not doing that because yeah. i'm blowing my nose in it that's disgusting i actually hate you second uh question is funniest prank on each other <laughs> can just, i go first yes just say <laughs> so i was like 10 and Terry was like 13 and she was in the bathroom and she was washing her hair so her head was over the bath and me and Terry were like we're both like can I swear no okay we're both poo scared of spiders like we absolutely hate them and um so she's like over the bath and then like I don't I walk into the bathroom like Terry Ann this is fine and she jumps up from washing her hair and she she like screams and runs she screams murder and mum comes upstairs and I'm laughing and then um yeah it was just really funny but she hates me for it yeah so anyway I don't really have a a prank that I've done on you Funniest moment then? I don't know. Well, to be fair, I always say that there's spiders when Sean, there's not. So, and obviously she, she's more scared than me. But yeah. So, if you could have anything off of your sister's face, what would you have? Do you want to go first? Uh, yeah, I think I'd probably have your eyebrows or your nose because she has a really cute nose like mine is just a bit gross um and we have like really short eyebrows in our family but Sean's always looked nice so yes I bet you're happy you've got a compliment in there somewhere um if I could have anything probably be your cheekbones because I'm quite like round face and like I have loads of baby fat still <laughs> so <laughs> I would, like you have really nice cheekbones and you have really nice lips. My our lips are really weird as well. They like go in. <laughs> yeah. Have, do, yeah. Do you guys um think we look alike? Because some people say that we do. Right. Let's just. I can't stop smiling now. Right. No, I can't. <laughs> Wait. Just be serious. I can't be serious. No, I can't. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, anyway, moving on. Okay, so next question is, what is your favourite food? Pizza. See, I am such a foodie. Like, my boyfriend always goes on about me talking about food 99% oh, of the time. My but to be fair, it is a bit of an addiction, really. I love pizza, meatballs. Mum makes such nice meatballs, but this one's really fussy. Um, I love, p yeah, pizza, chicken kiosk, garlic chicken kiosk, oh yes. Oh, they're good. Um, yeah. Chipolatas? No, I don't. I like chipolatas. I don't like bangers and mash. I don't like. I like, like, classic English foods. Yeah, um, you like yeah. shepherd's pie. Oh, yeah. PC shepherd's pie. Yeah, we call our nan PC. 
and she makes like oh, she makes the best freaking food like chicken oh her chicken goujons don't yeah she makes good. homemade chicken goujons and, and her honestly. meat pie that's really good as well there's like a stew bit she does food. better chicken goujons than M&S and you know that's pretty bougie when it's better than that mm. anyway um have you got any party tricks no no well I mean you could do splits yeah yeah that's I can do this with my eye. I can twerk. Well, we can both twerk. I'm not going to high five you on that if I'm honest with you. <laughs> Why? <laughs> so the next question is, what is your most embarrassing moment? Are you going to go first? Yeah. yeah go. Um. So at like family mm-hmm. gatherings, I'm quite clumsy. At family gatherings, everyone's like, oh, I'm like known to knock things over, so, like drinks and whatever. And then everyone's like, oh, it's not a party about Sean knocking something over or something like that. Yeah, you always knock things over. I'm clumsy, I fall over everything. Yeah. My most embarrassing (coughs) moment is when I was at my leavers dinner and I was sitting in front, well, like, across from a boy. Um, Lovely boy, don't really know him him very well. And I was basically wearing this dress, which is like this. And basically, I leant over to one side, I don't know why, and basically my boob came out. So that is the story. It was embarrassing. He started apologising to me, I started apologising to him. And apart from this video, let's hope I'm just never going to have to bring this up again. Okay, Okay. so nearly last question. Um, How did you find out that Santa wasn't real? I watched a YouTube video and a YouTuber was like, um, how did you, f- they were doing a Q&A and they were like, how did you find out Santa wasn't real? And then I told Oh no, them, what if I eventually reveal to someone that Santa isn't real? <laughs> oh, Sorry, no. Santa's real. Santa is real. Just skip this part of the video. <laughs> yeah, ignore what I say. Um, I found out that Santa wasn't real because usually, even now, like, I'm already 18 years old and I still wake up at, like, 4 o'clock in the morning on Christmas Day because I want to know what my presents are. And, um, basically, one day I woke up at, like, 2 um, and I heard my mum put it in my room. The next day, I said to her, Mum, I know that Santa's not real now. And she was going, no, 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 he is real, he's real. I, I'm just one of his elves. But it got to the point where I was just like, no, I, I just don't believe you anymore. I lost my faith in God. I lost my faith in everything. I knew that Santa wasn't real. But yeah, not to get deep or anything. But yeah. Last but not least, our final question is um, if you have one week, <laughs> one week to live, what would you do? So I think I'd do what anyone would do. I'd probably go skydiving. I'd spend all my money. I'd um, go out. I'd probably like book a flight somewhere. Like well, probably a one way flight. Yeah. Same, but then I'd rob a bank. Really? Yeah, I'd rob a bank and like bury the money for like, and then like make a treasure map, so, like for someone to find it. Maybe before I die, and I've, I've got to tell you something. And, like, you <laughs> you go find the treasure map in the room. Yeah. yeah. So that is all we've got time for today. Hope you guys have enjoyed this Q and A. Maybe um, next time I'll have enough subscribers to actually get you guys to ask some questions. But anyway, I hope you like my sister. That's I hope really you like me too. To yeah, it is. Why hope... did you say that? Because no, <laughs> no one was going to be like, I hate Chan. I hope you guys like this video. Subscribe. Thanks. Okay, so that is everything we've got time for. We need to film this again.